Hello, everybody. Welcome to Let's Try. My name is Retromation. This is Rungor, a self-proclaimed combination of Slay the Spire and Loop Hero. It is a real-time roguelike deck builder, meaning there's kind of like a an auto-battler element going on in the background, but in real time, you will play cards to influence that combat. So it's not really an auto-battler per se, because it's very active. It's just a real-time deck builder. So in we're going to be going. This is Rungor, the beginner experience, which I believe is kind of like a... Oh my god. Like a free demo version of it that's going to be coming out. Uh, one moment. Hello! Running forward is cool, but you know what's even cooler? For example, cold-blooded murder! Well, well alright. Battles happen automatically, so don't worry about them too much. Sorry. Just had to adjust the audio because it's so much louder in-game than it was at the menu. Battles happen automatically, so don't worry too about them too much. Okay. And yes, and this is the whole game. It's not. Uh, the art style is really interesting, though. The the motion on those guys? Look at that. Oh, hey, this cursed deck dropped some cards. Awesome, you can pick some of them up for the next battle if you feel like killing an enemy isn't enough. What, it isn't enough of a reward? Okay. Cure attacks opponent gives armor. Guess I'll add a couple cards for you. Use as many as you want. Turn your enemies into a bloody mess. Grind their bones into dust. More blood for the blood god. Exclamation, 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 exclamation one. <laughs> All right. Okay, so we could go wop, 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 wop. Fair enough. Goodbye. I'm going to assume that we'll have like a finite amount of cards that we sort of get. Maybe? I don't know. That armor rack didn't have any bones. Well, whatever. It did drop some equipment for you, though. So if you pick that up, it'll stay with you forever. Or until you equip something else in that same slot. Increase your attack by two. Okay, so we're going to have passive sort of relic equipment as well. Do we want to, like, use our cards or should we save them? You know what I'm saying? Because we healed up to full anyways. Oh, okay, that's... Well, that's right. Did you notice your health went up? That's because of your starting artifact. Every hero has one. It tries its best, so be grateful. <laughs> Boss Mr. Huggles. If you squint your eyes really hard, you can make out a silhouette of your next opponent and all their stats. But who cares? Cool kids blindly throw themselves into battle anyway. Don't play cards after five seconds. We'll give up. I'll move this window so it won't get in the way. Mm. Jesus. Don't play cards. I mean... Okay. I'm so curious what would happen if I played cards, though. Hey, congrats on defeating the boss. Seems you've reached the end of the tutorial. And now you have some more levels to do. Okay, bye bye Well, all right. I'm very curious to see Level Unlocked Jungle. Uh, how spicy this sort of... Oh, Jungle Dungeon? Okay, so we have like... It seems like maybe three characters in the uh, this version at the very least. Pioneered Kicking Down Doors, Night Guy. Okay. HP after battle. Understood. So we have... Apl <laughs> applies Mark. Should we put on shield? I mean, we're not really going to take very much damage. It looks like the shield stays. So, like, why even bother here? So then we get it. Yes, we do get to keep these cards. Gotcha. Choose three cards. Weapon increase your attack by one. I I'll do that. That seems permanent. Attacks give armor for four seconds. So is that just kind of like... A, is it sort of a passive we get? I'll take it. Attacks an enemy and adds armor equal to damage. Gives armor. Gives more armor. Attack and armor. Armor. Okay. Give Gives armor card. If an enemy is marked, gives another one. Gives... What do you mean gives armor card? Gives armor card. Let's go with this for now, though. Applies poison with every attack. I don't know. Is poison going to go through shields or what? Either way, I'm happy with this, I think. We got one damage and we're going to be taking a little bit of shielding. Okay. Okay, so that's just a passive we get for the whole fight here. That's so good. Okay, I mean, yeah, these fights are pretty easy right now. I'm going to assume that's not going to remain that way. Attacks an enemy and applies mark. Marks, okay, mark target takes 25% more damage. This, the art on this one is, I mean, I, I see what you did there. Doubles your current armor. Do that, that. Three armor up. Upgrades after each play. Okay, so clearly, okay, so we have 
a deck, apparently. What do you mean, otherwise, upgrades after each play, how would that be relevant? That wouldn't make any sense, then. Unless it's like every time we see that card in the future, it'll upgrade. You know, we should just let ourselves take a hit or so. Because we heal five. So we can take five damage, and it's technically technically optimal. It's technically optimal to take five damage instead of using a shield card. While you're running past some shady character, they manage to sell you a loot box. But which one? Azure, Aquamarine, Starlight. Starlight. Free cards! Applies mark, gives mark trigger card. So yeah, it, it, it's kind of... There's no mana cost to any card. The cost is basically, do you want to use it now or use it later? Every fourth attack gives you two armor. So that re that's a weapon replacement. Steals a card with every hit, gives them all back after death. Sure. Attacks an enemy, gives it, a, gives it an attack card. Sounds fun. Ah, so yeah. It seems like it upgrades that... We'll get you a mark there. Okay. So, keeps taking the cards I'm trying to get played here. Oh my god. Okay. So we took a little bit. Boss box. Every fourth attack slows down the opponent. I think we'll want to probably go all out. We'll get the double shields. Hero attacks an opponent. Wait, what do we see? This fearsome enemy has no abilities. Attacks for 0 to 24 damage. Ah. Uh, okay. Gotcha. Increase your attack speed by uh, for six seconds. Let's use both of those. I mean, we should also probably mark. Do we have the attack speed increase? Attacks enemy applies mark. Sure, why not? Okay, we need a shielding. Oh boy, wild. Heal 20%, so we can upgrade. Okay, gotcha, gotcha. We can upgrade to have that do 20% after combat. Doubles hero's attack until he takes damage. Resets each battle. Oh, that's pretty good. Saves half of his armor after battle. Oh, boy. These are really interesting. This is, like, they're all good. Let's go with this. Applies mark with each attack. So does Mark stack to eventually do more damage? Also, is this like a rare card? Gives you armor and makes you, but makes you lose it after three seconds. Gotcha. That seems good. Attacks give armor for four seconds. Let's just do it. Let's go all in here. Okay, so we move down to the next zone. I feel like we might be able to get away with just using that one card. Holy moly. Double double attack until you take damage. Fight start. Give two armor. Sounds good. Increase attack speed. Mark and a mark trigger card. So, like, we're kind of... There, there's deck building. But... We don't get to necessarily... Oh, shoot. I was hoping that we would... I mean, it's fine. It doesn't matter. Again, we stay at 50. As long as we don't take more than 5. Uh, these are just better boots. I'll take that. That card's getting very good. Attacks and then stuns an enemy for 2 seconds. Attacks an enemy if they're marked. Attack once more. That could be better. It's, eh, whatever. Say it could be better for us. Shield on there. I think... Okay, so you come back to life once, and then just... I should have read. I should have read the ability, huh? I should have read the ability. I should have read that one's ability. We were just going through things like crazy. You began to believe in the heart of the cards. Your cards liked it, your cards didn't like it. Actually, never mind, you did it. They increased their quality. Nice. What? Fight start, increase your attack by 12 for a second? 
Okay, you know what? That seems more fun. Uh, poison with every attack. It's just, it's just, it's just a vat of acid. <laughs> that I really like. Uh, increase your, at increase attack for five seconds. Increase it by three for five seconds. I'd rather get an attack speed, but, but the stun is nice. Oh, I thought that was shielding. Oh, I thought that was shielding. Man, you really do have to think fast there. Get Berserk. Gives 10 attack speed, but the hero takes 50% more damage. Hat increases attack speed for point... Oh, on block. Is it like on a successful block or whenever you play a block card? Neat. I'll take that. I do think that this one's solid. These have been getting really good too, though. You know what? Those have been getting so good, I think we just go for more. This fearsome enemy has no abilities. Yes, of course. Okay. Get all kinds of shielding on for a bit. We should be fine for a while. Uh, oh, pain. 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 I'm so glad we got that big heal. Why bosses are just boxes? <laughs> why are bosses just boxes achievement? And why are some of them so buff, it says. <laughs> guy has unlocked Ranger Guy. Unlocked the dungeon. Interesting. There's a warning that said, don't enter, you will die. You successfully ignored it. So I'm, guess I'm gonna assume that this one is more difficult. Interesting. Gives one second of dodge after every card played. Huh. All right. Hey, you encountered multiple enemies. This feature was for the full game. Well, whatever. You can choose your target. Show them your strategic power with this card. Okay, bye bye Ah, so Mark changes our target. Okay, so we no longer heal. Gives dodge for two seconds, applies poison. Every fourth attack deals critical damage. I mean, sure. Attack an opponent and give dodge. So we'll really have to... Those will really have to time well. Or, like, the dodges... No, you don't have to time the... Wait, yes you do. Because it only lasts for a certain amount of time. Oh my god. I don't know, man. This this character seems spooky by comparison. Uh, fight, start a random card in your hand, gets the effect, apply two poison. Cool. I, I'm going to go for probably artifacts or like equipment whenever I can. Gives a random card, applies poison, upgrades after each play. I think something like that we'll want to get early. Gives dodge for two seconds. So it's not like two stacks of dodge over the course of two seconds. It's just complete dodge for two seconds. So it's one second of dodge whenever you play any card. Let's go with a Aquamarine loot box. Free attack cards. Applies poison, does more. Fight start, give you crit one time. Increase attack by five, slow ease down the hero by ten. Sure. Okay, we probably, I guess we don't need two. Neat. <laughs> very neat, very wild. Is this a better one? No, it's the same one, right? Yeah, same one. Attacks and applies poison. Sure. Dodge for two seconds. Just in case. I'll take a hit. I probably shouldn't have taken two, though. Boss corpse. Just a corpse. Nothing interesting here. I don't know if I believe you. Att 
attack twice. Does crit. The next attack does more. Does... If we double the... If we double this damage, or if we, like, super crit this one... Does it work how I would maybe want? Oh my god, just play a bunch of cards here. Oh, he's ramping up. We have so much dodge, though. Okay, that's terri that was terrifying, but we're fine. You can take an extra card after battle and cre increase increases in increases i i with this game i don't even know if that's on purpose that might be on purpose <laughs> I, it's one of those games you know where i'm like hell maybe maybe i'm wrong maybe it is increases <laughs> that might be right <laughs> this game makes me question everything after card is played you have a 25 percent chance to draw a random card that seems so good with this character since we get invincibility Basically, I'll take the hat. Attacks, you get crit damage for four seconds. Applies crit X5 to your next attack. Wait, what? Every attack gives one second of dodge duration four. Interesting. Blows up after 10 seconds. I mean, can we dodge the attack? Can I... Can I dodge? Dodge it? I don't know how much I trust that. Yeah, we can just dodge it. I don't know what card I wasted, but that worked out well. When an enemy misses, apply po poison. That's actually so much better for what we're doing. Gives a basic attack. Poisonous and dodge cards. That sounds good. Just skip three cards. Poison equal to the hero's attack. Attacks by poison. Tax the opponent and give it dodge. I think for for right now, we again we should make sure we look at the Uh oh. Make sure we have dodge. Yeah, it's a mirror. So I guess we didn't have dodge for one second there. Increase heroes by five. Gives dodge one second for each poison applied to enemies. That could be good. Okay. Hey, dude. Want to cut your HP? Cut it in two? Sure, cut it in four. And I'll have a small sepsy with it. Here, you're double damage, sir. I honestly, yes. Every attack applies a poison. Sure. I'll have that instead. Attack twice. I just think I like I really need to go for dodge silliness. Okay. Holy moly. Okay, yeah, I mean our damage is obscene. Die if remain dies if remains alone. Scroll enemies with mouse wheel. I don't I don't have the ability to mark. Applies poison equal to hero's attack. Oh my god. We're fine. We're fine. We're doing stupid damage. Every three attacks slows down the opponent. Not right now. Every attack gives dodge. Sounds really nice. Attack twice. Gives a random card. Splits after death. I mean, of course it does. I mean, of course, it's a slime. Applies poison, 100% chance for this card to return to your hand instantly. The chance gets lower with each play. I'll take both of those. 
because the whole dodge up situation seems really nice. Attacks and gives a random poison. I mean, it's the same as this one, more or less, for us. Okay, we wanna we wanna go silly with it. More, 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 more. Play it all. What is happening? Um. Um. Is the joke that it never stops? Nope. I thought, I thought, okay. I think I had to use everything there. Maybe. Probably didn't. Increased applied dodge effect by a second. Berserk effect when you dodge. More damage, more stupid. Okay, we need we need more cards, though. More damage, more stupid, more cards. Nope. Sure. Text twice. Just want sort of quicker things for now. Man, yeah, I like that they have the enemy shown there, but the fact that they're only there partially and then you and then it goes away, that that's tricky to. Okay. Dodge is going away. We gotta be pretty quick with it. We wanna just take anything that makes us get multiple cards or get more dodge. Like, that's huge. That's really good. Sure. Okay, watching our dodge. Excuse me. Please die faster. Oh, I don't love that. Don't love that. Okay, this is, this is nice. Poison upgrades after each play. Grants do eh, double damage. Sure. Attack apply. Wait. Attack applies to a, a random effect to everyone. And there's two of them. You jerk. Okay. I like whatever the heck happened. Do you have free will? Nope. You can't pick cards after battle anymore. Instead, you get five random ones. I gotta be honest. Great. As long as we don't... We gotta we gotta memorize the picture of that one that makes it so dodge doesn't work. That would kill us. Just watch the dodge. Keep Just keep the dodge up and we're good. I'm just trying to make sure, uh, where's that one that, make sure I don't look at it. All right, sorry, give dodge for three seconds. I mean, that, honestly, this would be so good right now. Oh, if only. Again. Okay, watch the dodge, we're at five seconds. Three, one, watch it. Hands get witch's attack. I mean, yeah. Okay, nothing dangerous. I mean, that one arguably I don't want, I guess. I'm just a Gatling gun right now. And I get so many cards. That was, like, going for no free will was such a good pickup for us. Okay, the fact that it's a, a thousand health, though, has me concerned. We might need to watch carefully. Okay, getting ready, getting ready. Oh, this is so stressful. I just didn't trust it. Okay. 
Nope, don't play that one. Just don't play the far this left one. Okay, we got it. All right, just pay attention. Not stressful at all. Not stressful at all. Just time it right. Oh my god. Wait. There's a hundred. Okay, there's. There's literally two minutes of um, dodge now. <laughs> that's two minutes of. That's two minutes of dodge. My hands are off the keyboard. You know how I said this wasn't an auto battler? I just made it an auto battler. I mean, it, it is, it's an auto battler with another game on top of it. I may need to actually play another card. I mean, man, we're doing it. We're freaking doing it. Is this supposed to be like a demo boss where you're like, you're not going to beat this. Just like, don't, just don't do this. Just like, stop. Or is this overpowered of a build just really common? Because we're adding an extra poison every single attack here. Lol. Achievement. He do be dead, though. <laughs> Achievement. He do be dead, though. And that's why it matters how you use your HP and not the size of it. Yep. What a wonderful performance. I didn't expect to fight so fiercely for the ability to run. But what is he running towards? To the right. You know what's to the right? What? Goals and ambitions, grandson. And that guy won't stop at anything that comes at him. He will use anything he can, flipping rules and balance upside down. Fair. <laughs> Until he arrives at his destination. But there's nowhere to run anymore, Grandpa. What do we do now? We can only wait. For the full version. <laughs> this... That may be, like, the best ending to, like, a free demo version of a game I've ever seen. <laughs> uh, have we... Did we not unlock the third character? Log guy, that's what I thought. We're definitely gonna play as log guy. Yeah, it says you will die. I'm pretty confident that the real tutorial. Wait, this is the tutorial God's domain. You better not anger him. What do you mean real tutorial? Attacks after every exhaust. Okay. I'm curious what you mean real. Gives a random card exhaust. Hey, wait. You are not a newbie. Oh, no. Okay. Increases attack speed by three for every exhausted card for five seconds. Unexhausts a random card. Gives armor exhaust. Huge. You... What do you mean you can't draw this card anymore? Like, th is th in this game, is this considered drawing? I think that might be the case. Every eight, a eight attacks, unexhaust a card. So it, exhaust means it probably can't show up here. Increase attack speed by three for every exhausted card for five seconds. Stun enemy exhaust. This is a weird one. Uh, attack applies to a random, random effect to everyone. Um. What is happening here? This here is the tutorial god's domain. We should have shielded first. What the hell? If you play four exhausts in a battle, it gives two cards and gets destroyed. What do you mean, it? 
of the boots. Hyper exhaust, the next card. Deleted from reality, it will not come back ever. <laughs> All right. Stun an enemy exhaust. This is a, this character's weird. The dummy's back to life. I guess I'm just gonna take this hit. If I, yeah, if I have to. Huh. Every fourth attack gives four armor. I just need, I need stability. Two armor, plus two for every exhausted card. Exhaust. Sure. Gives armor, increased attack, and stuns the hero for four seconds. Exhaust. Give attack X2 armor. Gives attack X2 armor. Armor equal to times two my attack. Okay. So, like, taking two cards that both can exhaust, like, that are the exact same, seems good. Like, you know what I'm saying? Theoretically, since it's going to exhaust anyways, unless when I exhaust, it gets rid of all of them. I mean, this is terrifying. We need to go all in. It does not. Okay. Well, that was probably fine. Are you, like, perma-stunned? Well, welcome to the tutorial zone. You encountered a super secret tutorial about how to destroy your deck. <laughs> uh, I mean... What could go wrong? All common cards are now unplayable. All common and epic cards are now unplayable. Good luck with the boss. <laughs> Yeah, I'm with you there. I, I you, you let me destroy my deck. It sounds neat. Every second attack deals critical damage. Gives Berserk while this card is exhausted. Um, I don't think I can do that. I don't think I can take 50% more damage. Damage. He has 20% of max HP exhaust. That's nice right now. Two cards exhaust. Play everything I got, to be honest. We had we were stunned. I had the I had the play card there, otherwise we would probably die. Uh increase attack speed until the end of battle. Sure. Fearsome enemy has no abilities. Slows down his opponents with each attack. Oh my god. I don't think I have any shielding. And by that, I mean I'm confident I don't have any shielding. So we just have- we have to just Gatling destroy everything. Okay. Uh, plus four attack speed if four cards are exhausted. They are. I mean, let's go with this for now. I'm gonna die here. Unless these guys can't attack. They can't. They can't. Get a super secret tutorial about how to sell your soul to the tutorial god. You completed a secret level. Let's go. We did it, gang. Secret level beaten. Achievement lull. <laughs> Wrong option, probably. Wrong option, maybe. It says. Okay. Fair enough. I mean, I I could have assumed it was going to be bad. I didn't think it was going to literally kill me, but I was going to die anyways. Uh, let me hit you with a... Can we retry that? I just don't understand this character. So I, I like that they make the tutorial a new boss. Huh. What a, what a character. Hey, wait, you are not a newbie. Yep. Shields up first. 
I guess. I will do that, sure. Two exhausted cards, exhaust. Fight, start, unexhaust two cards. That seems like a good way to keep our pool allowed. Like, to have cards in it? Unless... Fine. So there are currently no exhausted cards, theoretically. Okay, we should be fine. Uh, please, please die. Please die. We were supposed to be fine. We were supposed to be fine. Fight, start, give eight armor. We get rid of those. Which is maybe okay. I won't have very many. Hero attacks an opponent. <laughs> so this is probably what's left for when you have nothing. Uh, sure. Just shield up like crazy, man. We should be fine. Now the question is if I want to shield up there and block that one. I guess so. Eight overflow that we probably shouldn't have done, but now we have no defensive cards. That one just terrified me last time. I felt like I needed to go for it. Unexhaust three cards and stuns the hero for three seconds. Stun an enemy exhaust. Two cards exhaust. Yeah. All right. Bonk. Let me do it too. Do I just take this damage? No, oh no, we did we crit or something? Oh, so we have to do this. Okay. I'm gonna do Hmm. I don't know. I don't think that this was necessarily the issue. So this has to happen. This is guaranteed to happen for this character in this zone. Which is kind of cool. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know that that was inherently the issue. Like, there's nothing I can do. That one, that one has to happen. Increase text by for one second. Random card exhaust. I mean, I would like to take those later, so maybe I don't take them now. Sure. That freaking cone's got a gun. That should be fine, Achilles. Ah, you stun. That's what you do. You little jerk. Oh, that is annoying. Probably should have done this one instead. Increase your attack by one. Yes, please. I don't mind taking the hyper exhaust card once. I think we just need more cards. One, two. We will. Ha okay, we'll have enough. Oh my god, what the hell? Taking one damage. Just get out of here. Just get out of here. God dang it, man. Just get out. And get the witch's attacks. Yes. Let's finally get the hyper exhaust. Sure. Sure. Bing, bang, boom. Fine. 
Tutorial got us angry. Do two damage to yourself. Hmm, seems pretty good. That seems like a yep. Yeah, we're running out of cards that we... We have to choose another card? Well, shouldn't have done that. Unexhaust that, please. Please unexhaust that. Please unexhaust that. Is it still exhausted? It is. If I start getting armor. Oh, you know what? We have to go with these. I think we just... Oh, shoot. I got got. I got got. Game sucks. I got got. I was I was clicking through. I was saying I was wondering what happens with this teddy bear. I actually probably could have killed him though. Funny enough. To be fair, part two. I'm not confident this game wouldn't make it so the second time you fight this enemy, it doesn't do the same thing. I'm not confident that it's like five seconds and then you will just die anyways. I'm not confident. <laughs> <laughs> alas, alas, though. That's that. That's gonna do it for today. This has been Run Gore. I, uh, I'm really looking forward to this now. What the hell? This is so weird. This is so weird. Uh, I enjoy it. It's hectic. It's chaotic. Um, a, a positive end minus for the game is sort of the fact that it runs lack, like, run identity to an extent which is not necessarily bad and is not fully true like you get run identity through the equipment to an extent um but that's kind of where the the line is drawn so like as far as what would replayability of the game look like when it's out i'm not so sure uh due to as a result of that fact but the, the fact is the character that we played would probably largely play a pretty similar way each time and we could change completely the way we play the fights from one fight to the next which again is not a downside it's just it's just different you know it is just a different thing it, it, you are making a a deck builder on the fly but not really getting attached to your deck you could make an argument that you could potentially get more attached to the uh, the deck with this sec like the the third character here also, of course, that's where I left my mouse. <laughs> uh, you could make an argument you could get attached to the deck in a different way with this character because of the exhaust elements, but everything is so impermanent, it's hard to get attached to it, which, I don't know. I, it'd be cool to see ways for that to be, like, not changed, but, like, alleviated to an extent. Um, like, I don't know how many equipment slots there are, but I think another one <laughs> or something could already be like that could be a big thing it's like i think that making sure that you will get relatively reliable equipment and make sure that there's a relatively reliable amount of slots for those equipment uh pieces so that you can truly have a little bit more of a uh, run with an identity i think that that would be cool without without changing basically that much at all about what the game really has to offer i think leaning into that element would help that uh, if that's something that matters. <laughs> Again, maybe it doesn't. Maybe it doesn't. Maybe you want every run to be able to feel uh, so flexible and on the fly that it basically feels the same as a different run. That being said, I'm very excited for this regardless. I'm very excited for this. I think it's new. I think it's different while being outrageously the same. <laughs> like, it's so new because it's co obviously copying some elements from a lot of different areas, but it puts them together in a package that is ultimately new. Uh, to an extent like there is obviously the spire dna there's obvious loop hero dna but they said that out of the they said that out of the gate um so you know what a surprise that 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 was very clear but it is different and uh, the tone the visuals everything very very different uh cool game very cool game run gore check it out uh there will be i think a free um look like the thing that i'm playing right now I believe you'll be able to check it out for free on Steam, uh, hopefully today when this video comes out. If it's not out already, it should be in an hour or so. 
Uh, but otherwise, I'm, I'm going to definitely wishlist the full version and hopefully cover it when that comes out. But alas, that's going to do it for today. If you like roguelikes, if you like roguelikes, anything like that, uh, roguelikes or, or roguelikes or roguelites, uh, this is the channel for you. You're going to want to make sure you're subscribed to this channel. I cover all the greatest new stuff in that genre that comes out every single day. Thank you for watching. Thank you, thank you. And I will see you next time. Bye.